I'm Dr. Gail Sullivan, Editor-in-Chief of the Journal of Graduate Medical Education, and I'm here today with Dr. Paraga Mehta, who is Vice Chair of the Department of Medicine and Chief Medical Information Officer for the New York Methodist Hospital in Brooklyn, New York. And we're here to talk about his paper that was published in the February 2016 issue uh, called Racing Against the Clock, Internal Medicine Residents' Time Spent on Electronic Health Records. So Dr. Mehta, what made you want to study this topic? So there are so many surveys which are self-reported and most of them say that we are spending too much time on the electronic health records. When I found out that my EHR can track the active use by the clicks, keystrokes, or the mouse movement, I was super excited that I want to help my physician and my EHR to develop better solutions. When I start keep getting the data to improve the efficiency, it was an amazing data, and I thought that I must share with the rest of the world so that everybody can improve. So we studied the data from July, October, and January. So these are the young enthusiastic residents and their computer savvy. And we compared them at the end of the year, that is May, that what difference it makes, the training as well as the clinical comfort. Well, what were the most unique or surprising findings from your study? The unique and the surprising finding is that the self-reported surveys were correct. The amount of time residents are spending on electronic health record in the month of July is almost 40 minutes per encounter. If somebody is seeing 10 patients, it's a 400 minutes. And by the end of J January, this time is statistically significant, which is 30 minutes. But still, it's a lot of time per encounter. So they are spending 300 minutes just on the computer in the day if they're carrying 10 patients. Wow. Well, given these findings, what are your next plans in this area? We actually started already. So we now are coming closer than the physicians and the IT. We started developing tool which will improve the user satisfaction. And the way I see it, that the electronic health record has too much of information and just like an ocean. If somebody wants to go out for a treasure hunt, they have to take a deep dive to find pertinent positive or pertinent negatives. We will bring that treasure all the way closer to them. So if you are having certain specialty, what you need will be on one page. So review of the chart will be easier. We will try to improve the documentation, mainly if abnormal labs or radiological results should be coming with one click. And then we created order sets based on the guideline. So that will not only reduce the time, but also improve the patient safety and the quality of care. And I hope that everybody will start doing such kind of innovations. Well, thank you very much. I'm sure many residents will be grateful for your work in this area. That concludes our Spotlight on Authors for February 2016. I hope you all read the paper. It's quite interesting. <laughs>